guys welcome back to my channel so today's video we are going to be cleaning out my car and I'm going to show you how I organize everything different products I use to help me stay organized in the car and things that work for us in our van so um, right now I'm just cleaning out the car I do try to clean out the car like every Friday just kind of clean it all out um, today was a little more in depth but yeah this is what we're doing I normally take three trash bags or target bags um, and I put one, I fill it with the trash. The second one I'll fill with what needs to go back in the car. And the third one I'll usually put things that need to go elsewhere, like in the house and stuff. Um, so I'll put that in the third bag. But the very first thing I do after I take everything out is I will go ahead and vacuum the car out. Now Brantley was helping me vacuum, so I did used our Dyson, and then he was using our car vacuum, which is amazing. It's literally one of my favorite features about this van. Uh, we have a Chrysler Pacifica. It is a 2018, and we absolutely love it. I think vans are really, really nice to have when you are a mom. So I forgot to mention before we vacuumed, I actually took out all the mats in the car just so that we could hose them down, scrub them down with soap and get them nice and clean because they do get muddy. And so I like to do that too sometimes. Right here, I'm just um, just vacuuming out the car seats. Our car seats get so nasty. I do let my kids um, eat in the car. I probably shouldn't, but I do. And yeah, so I just had to vacuum out the car seats as well. And then I took uh, baby wipes. I actually used the Young Living Seedlings wipes and I wiped off all of the plastic and leather pieces in the car with the wipes. It actually helps the car smell really good because the Seedlings wipes are infused with essential oils. And so it makes the car smell really good and I feel like they work really good. I could use like a towel or something, but it just was easier for me this day. I don't always use the wipes. Sometimes I'll use a towel, but yeah, here's Brantley helping me spray off the mats and he ended up scrubbing them for me and hosing them down for me. He did a great job and I just continued to vacuum out the car because it was a disaster. But seriously, you guys, this vacuum, it's amazing to have in my car. I'm obsessed. Like I was saying, I did use baby wipes and I just wiped down all of the plastic pieces, the doors. I just wiped down everything with baby wipes and the back of the seats, the actual seats. These are the wipes I use. They're the Young Living Seedlings wipes. They smell so good, you guys. So good. I don't know if they're fine for the leather. Leather, I've never noticed anything. Um, I've actually used these in my old car too. I've never noticed anything. Um, in fact, they work really good. So. Uh, yeah, that is what I use. I also use the wipes to wipe down the steering wheel and help disinfect it. And then I also wiped out the cup holders and all the pieces in the inside we hosed down and washed, um, like the plastic pieces that go in where you guys can see right there. Um, we wiped or we took those out and cleaned those out as well. I don't know how this stuff gets so dirty, but it does. So next you see me here, I was, I was using a e-cloth towel. I like to use that too to clean my car. It works really good. All you need is water. I love e-cloths, they're really good to clean with. And then I used a dusting one to wipe down all of the parts right here, um, just so nothing got like scratched. And I didn't really wanna put any um, liquid or anything like that, any water or anything on the what is that called? I don't know, whatever that area is called. But here's me again, just wiping down all the pieces, the back trunk area. This part gets so dirty, you guys, where the stroller goes in. Ugh, the trunk was a mess. But yeah, and then I also use that e-cloth. Um, I'll use that to wipe down my kids' car seats. It works so good. You could use baby wipes for this too, but it takes up so many baby wipes. 
So I use an e-cloth and it works so good. It cleans up the spots really, really well. And um, yeah, you just see me here. That's what I did for all three of the car seats. Um, Hazen's didn't need it, but the three boys, their car seats, since they eat in the car, were a mess. And this, you can see, just works really good and helps everything get clean um, without using like 90 wipes, because that's probably how many it would take to use in the car seats. <laughs> And last but not least, I just went ahead and used essential oils in my little car diffuser. I don't like to use any toxic things, so um, I just use essential oils. I put them in the little bottle and I have my little car diffuser that makes my car smell good. Now I'll show you guys how I organize, so let's get started with that. Okay you guys, so right here I have n I keep nothing except for a um, thing of tissues and this is found at Target and it just is a perfect like cup holder tissue thing. And so if it's perfect there and then right here which is essential I just have an umbrella um, just in case then um, right here in the center I just have a wipes because I feel like I always just need wipes for different things um, so you'll notice I have like a million wipes in my car um, this is just a phone charger right here I keep my thieves uh, waterless hand purifier because germs I just like to keep my hands clean and I'll use this to I'll give this to Gunner and yeah and then we have the cup holders right here and then in this spot right here I just have my glasses case easy pass and a hair tie and I think a pen under there yep a pen and that's it this car also has storage right here and right here um, I usually just place my phone in here when I'm driving um, right here you can put like change and different things but ours is just empty and then right here I keep my uh, essential oils diffuser like basically just to keep my um, car smelling good and it's just like a little uh, macrame type thing um, diffuser it just has a little bottle in there and I just put whatever oils I want right now I have lime and frankincense so but yeah it makes the car smell really good okay so coming into the back underneath the baby seat I just have a couple non-perishable snacks so in this little container this is from Target it's a sterilite container I just have a bag of veggie straws I have some almond butter biscuits I have a couple like crackers peanut butter crackers and a few lollipops and actually my kids don't even know that that's in there I just shove it under her seat and it works perfectly another must-have that I love is this mirror for Hazelyn we can hang toys off of it and it allows me to see her I love that and I love these mats these mats are perfect for the car seat um, so that when she does when she is able to reach she can't kick the seat also it's good it actually helps her car seat like not slide around so I love having this as well so over on this side I have nothing in the passenger side um, this is the spot where the umbrella was on the other side and it is for an umbrella um, but we just have one in the car right now and in this glove compartment I have basically um, just car stuff and then I have an extra little like hook to put on the seat in case so I will hook this on my seat and then it allows me to hang my diaper bag so that my diaper bag doesn't fall on the floor so I love having that and I just had it in here right now because me and Kyle were both in the car. Um, and then this is essential too. Um, I've used this many times. It might sound gross, but I hate porter potties. And so this is a travel john. So it's a disposable urine urinal for children, women, and men. And it works really good. And we have used this. So I just have that in there, in case of emergency. And then in here I also have a little emergency kit. So my friend actually got this for me, but it's just a few things like hairspray, cotton swabs, an extra hair tie, bobby pins, um, I think there's like blotting wipes, I'm not exactly sure, a nail file, just a bunch of little things. But my friend got this for me, so I figured I would put it in the car, I thought that was a good spot for it. Also in my opinion, it is key to have what all weather mats in your car when you have kids because it makes it so much easier to clean out so I highly recommend um, also these hooks right here um, you can use them for grocery bags or anything like that but I 
right now just wanted to show you that when we have t-ball or a sport I like to pack this backpack full of stuff for Gunner to do while we're at the sporting event um, but yeah so this just keeps all of his little things in there and um, I just wanted to show you guys we don't need it in there anymore because it's summertime we don't have any sports but it works great to just put that in there and then right here I just have a couple books for him for the car in this like elastic thing and then immediately when he gets in the car, he wants his Mr. Buckles. So we always have this just sitting in his car seat because once he gets in, he will want this. And it just keeps him busy. He can buckle and buckle. There's all different kinds of buckles on here. There's numbers and flaps with different animals. And like I said, he just loves it. So we just keep that right here because he'll want that immediately when he gets in the car. Over on Hazlin's um, where her seat is, I don't have anything in this back pocket. And then right here, there is a spot for drinks, which we do use. If you pull it out even more, there is storage. However, we don't use it. And my favorite part, my favorite part about the whole car, the vacuum. The stow can go back. It's amazing and so useful, especially when you're on the go and you can just quickly vacuum your car when you're not even home. It's the best feature ever. This car is made for a mom. I'm, I swear I love it. Um, but anyway, over here there's two cup holders, a little, another little spot, and then there is a USB um, outlet, which is great. And then right here on the back, I like to keep a trash can um, for the boys back here because they are the ones who often throw trash on the floor. And then I have this little hook here that holds the trash can just so it doesn't fall off. And it, I wrapped it around twice so that it doesn't fall off. And then this little caddy I got off Amazon. It is perfect for all their things and all the um, miscellaneous things. Just have right here some hand sanitizer um, that they can apply themselves when they're done, like at a park or something. And then I have some wipes just here on the side. There's a whole empty space right here that they can throw toys, trucks, whatever they bring with them anywhere, just so that the things don't land on the floor. Um, right here I have their cups right now. However, they don't usually put them here. So this would be like another spot. I just wanted to show you guys that it does fit cups very nicely um, and prevents them from spilling because the elastic goes pretty far down. Um, usually they will keep their cups in, the cu in their cup holders, but I just, for video purposes, I wanted to show you guys that. And then back here we have their hats, um, all three of their hats, just in case we are out. Also two elastic pockets. We keep sunglasses in there for them. They have some notepad, some paper, and some books um, for them all back here too. But we are loving this caddy and it seriously just helps keep everything so organized. So in the back here, I do keep our huge Bob single jogging stroller. And it is big, but it fits really good if you stand it up like this. And then behind here, I have the seat for the baby, which I usually baby wear her. So we don't usually need that, but once in a while we do. So I just have that back there. And then in this bag, this came with the card, has all of like the emergency things like jumper cables and things like that. Um, so that's in there behind the Bob stroller. And the Bob stroller I usually use for Gunner. Um, and I like to have this one specifically just because we are usually trucking through grass and um, sometimes gravel. And so we just like to have this one in here. Um, and then right here I just have a bag full of like car things, um, which I'll go through in a second. Over here this is like, like a tire service kit and I also have, um, I had some extra of these because it came with a pack of six I think. So I just threw those in here. So if we use the ones in the front, I'll put them um, back in the front when we're done. This is just the vacuum um, thing that you empty when it's full. Uh, also back here I have some more of these hooks in case I need to hang a bag or something, um, just so it doesn't take up any floor space. So I have that. And I do have a lot of space right here. Again, we have the weather meds back here. And in this bag, this is a 31 bag. It's one of the larger ones. Um, and then this one back here is the smaller one. It's both well, it's the large. I think this one's like the extra large. Uh, I don't know the terms, proper terms, but this one I'll use for like Costco when we go. And then um, in this, I'll 
show you guys what I have. So in here we just have some sunscreen, some Think Baby sunscreen, some bug balm stuff. I have some more sunscreen in there. I have some more wipes, a whole package of wipes. I know you're not really supposed to have plastic bottles in the hot car, but just in case I have a plastic bottle of water, I have one of these um, blankets for outside. It's from Target and it cleans up really well. In this little pouch right here, I just have a change of clothes for all of my kiddos. Um, and then I do have like a little activity thing for them, a little Paw Patrol and a little travel case of crowns, just in case. Um, and then I have our emergency kit, emergency med kit, which has a bunch of things in it. Um, I have some extra swim diapers just in case. I have another blanket. I have an extra cup in case I forget to bring Gunner's cup. Um, we have a football and a frisbee, like one of these flyer frisbees, which my kids love, um, just so they have something to do if we go somewhere that there isn't much for them to do. So um, I have a roll, I have a roll of paper towels. I have a couple more of these little waters. This is um, just a diaper clutch, skip hop diaper thing. And this has just diapers and wipes for both Hazlin and Gunner. And then back here, I have a travel potty. So, I think that's everything. Oh, one more thing, I have our socks for when we go to Sky Zone, which is like a jumping place. So I have our socks back there too, just in case. Because sometimes we don't know we're gonna go there and that way I'm prepared. Okay, you guys, so that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe while you're here. I'd love to have you a part of my YouTube family. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. You are.